And what is going on everybody? I am here with a brand new Let's Play and it is a Bioshock Infinite and uh, during my my zombie uh, walkthrough uh, I did say at the end of the series that uh, I'll be going off the little uh, I'll be going off the beaten path and uh, take a break from uh, um, horror games and uh, do something a little bit more outside of the box I guess uh, you you, uh, you can say from um, my from uh um from my videos of me just doing a lot of horror stuff but uh I'm, we're gonna be doing bioshock infinite the center of the center of debate when this came out in 2013 and has changed the way of how single player games uh have i guess you could say worked or have been played ever since uh bioshock uh, infinite and including uh the last of us also uh bioshock is not the only one uh, to uh, change uh, the way of how single player games have been um, I get worked on and I played on but Bioshock has been uh, one of them and we'll be and, and we'll be seeing why as we get into it and I'm super excited to actually to start playing this because like I said it, it's been it's been in the center of the bait for very lot for ever since the game came out in 2013 it has nothing but have been the center of the bait and it's gonna be very exciting to see uh, it's gonna be very exciting I just I just I just can't wait and now oh so I can't uh, I haven't uh, downloaded the, the season pass because I, I, I did pre-order this game because I'm, I've been a huge fan of um, of the Bioshock series and I pre-ordered this game when it was first announced. So before we actually get into the to the game, I want to make sh sure uh, it's on audio. Uh, subtitles are on. Okay. Okay, the subtitles have been on. Okay, so then let's go into the main game. Uh, we're gonna do a new game because when starting up the game. Uh, it uh, loaded up my um, my other file for my uh, in my 360, so we got to uh, restart it. Yeah, this will override uh, the current files. That's fine. I don't really care. And now uh, we're gonna start. Now, now there's several modes, uh, several uh, difficulties uh, that uh, you'll be going on uh, that, that you'll be seeing. It is easy. If you're new to FPS games and still want to control the action, uh, start here. Medium, if you know the basic FPS games, then uh, this is the best for you to start. Hard, if you're very experienced, yeah, you know. And then, and then we have the 1999 mode. Uh, this hardcore mode is the best of, is for the best of the best. Yes. Uh, to unlock uh, 1999 mode, you have to beat the game once, or uh, there is a uh, cheat code that you can uh, place, but I, I don't remember. I don't remember the cheat code uh, by memory, and and I didn't even know about it until uh, yeah, even I didn't know about it until uh, that there was a cheat code when um, I saw it on a uh, on a uh, a gaming site and explaining. Uh, uh, the the uh, a secret level or well, not I wouldn't say a secret level but an unlockable level, so we're gonna do medium because I play a lot of F FPS games so uh, I should be I uh, shoot I I know what the what I'm doing. Afraid of God? No. But I'm afraid of you. The mind of the subject will desperately struggle to create memories where none exist. That quote will become important as we get into the game. 1912, coast of Maine. Are you going to just sit there? As compared to what? Standing. Not standing. Rowing. Rowing. On it. So you expect me to show the this? burden? No, I do expect you to do all the rowing. 
And why is that? Coming here was your idea. My idea? I made it very clear that I don't believe in the exercise. The rowing? No. Imagine that's wonderful exercise. Then what? The entire thought experiment. Excuse me. How much longer? One goes into an experiment knowing one could fail. But one does not undertake an experiment knowing one has failed. Can we get back to the rowing? I suggest you do. No, We're work. never going to get there. No, I mean I'd greatly appreciate it if you would assist. Perhaps you should ask him. I imagine he has a greater interest in getting there than I do. I suppose he does. But there's no point in asking. Why not? Because he doesn't row. He doesn't row? No, he doesn't row. Ah, I see what you mean. Yeah, hey, I'm right here. We've arrived. Shall we tell him when we'll be returning? Would that change it? We might give him some comfort. Well, at least that's something we can agree on. Hey! Somebody meeting me here? I'd certainly hope so. It does seem like a dreadful place to be stranded. Well, maybe there's someone inside. Hmm. Well, there they go. Leaving me stranded in this lighthouse. Then uh, there should be yes, there are silver eagle coins that uh, you'll be collecting. It will be your currency throughout the game. So finding them, so finding them is actually very important. So remember that. Now the one thing I do, I do hate uh, uh, about the uh, Bosch, about the uh, Bioshock uh, series is the lack of controls. Now I don't know. And I can't. S oh, no, the controls of the game. Okay, uh. Sensitivity, let's raise that up a little bit because it's too slow. No, save changes. Okay, let's see. Yeah, that's better. That could work. DeWitt, bring us the girl and wipe away th the debt. Booker DeWitt? This is your last chance. Uh, I guess you're expecting me? Of thou sins shall I wash thee. Good luck with that, pal. There's some little eagle horns back here. I want to collect as much as I can. As we get in, as we get further into the game. Is anyone here? Hello? No one's gonna be here, uh, Booker. I better get away. Well, better get away from that. It's probably copywritten. We got some civil stuff. Okay. Wait. Let's look at this map here. I don't know if this map has anything. Be prepared. He's uh he's on his way. You must stop him. C. Hmm. To thine own land shall I take thee. Jesus, this place is a mess. Shit. Don't disappoint us. Yeah, they murdered this guy. In New Eden uh, soil shall I plant thee. And I forgot to see if there's. Oh, there's a bell here. 
with some eagle points. And we see uh, a, a perhaps a city nearby. I guess that's where we were. Oh yeah, right. We gotta use. Uh, we got a little bit of puzzle. A first puzzle here, which they gave us a hint to. It's the end of the world. That is some scary stuff. That also re that reminds me of um, there's a conspiracy theory out there. Of, I don't know if that relates to this. Of um, what was that? What was it called? Something skies. I don't know if if, any, if anyone has uh, seen videos about it of people around the world uh, soon hearing uh, like what sounds like wars, similar to that of what we just heard. I forgot what I forgot what they what were they called. All right, looks like they expect me to sit in their fancy chair. Yes, that's right, Booker. Uh, I don't. What was it called? Roaring skies. Something skies, or trumpet or or, or trumpet skies, something like that. Where uh, a trumpet-like sound uh, can be heard, can be heard uh, very loud in the distance, and has been heard all around the world, from Brazil, Singapore, including here in the U.S. So I don't know if that's maybe it's what inspired this little scene right here. That I don't know. Make yourself ready, Pilgrim. The bindings are there as a safeguard. No, no, God damn it! Ascension. Ascension in the count of five. No, count of four. No, no, no. Three. Two. One. Ascension. Ascension. Five thousand feet. Ten thousand feet. Father Comstock, our prophet. <laughs> Why would he send his savior unto us? If we will not raise the finger for our own salvation, and that and though we deserve not this mercy. Not his mercy, and has he led us to his uh, to this old Eden, our last chance for redemption? And so now we've been here. Now we've been uh, reading a lot of religious terms, so you could kind of figure out where this would be going. And the prophet shall lead the people to the new Eden. Okay, now we can move now. Find the way into the city. Well, that, uh, of course, I'm not gonna stay in this in this forever. Find a way into the city. Yes, I know that. 
Are we finding some some silver uh, silver coins here? Seed of the prophet. <laughs> the seed of the prophet shall sit the throne and drown the flame, the mountains of men. The welcome center. Excuse me. Where am I? Heaven, friend. Or as close as we'll see till Judgment Day. Hmm. Just keep such questions to myself, unless I want to get made. And in my wound shall grow the seed of the prophet. Well, there's coins here that uh, people are leaving here. There's nothing here. Okay. And now we have a... A, a, a collectible slash something that you will uh, see a lot often. It is a voxophone. A, vo a voxophones uh, are scattered through all about uh, throughout the game, and gotta find the exit. yeah, we gotta find. Of course, but I'm explaining something here, Booker, and uh, we'll just uh, you, you could just learn more about the backstory and the uh, characters that we'll be encountering throughout the game. And uh, it's I don't not too sure if it's uh, I I think it is uh, well uh, it is uh, rec not recommended towards one hundred percent but uh, you do get an achievement if you collect uh, all uh, voxophones now there are in total of uh, eighty there are a total of of eighty five uh, voxophones that uh, that uh, you need to find or if you want to find. It's totally up to you, but if you want to find, if you want to hear more about the story and the characters that we will encounter, as I said, you will, you do want to collect these voxophones. Love the prophet because he loves the sinner. Love the sinner because he is you. Without the sinner, what need is there for a redeemer? Without sin. Grace has forgiveness. So now we know the name of the lady here, which is Lady Comstock. Now, Lady Comstock will uh, will be referenced uh, as we go further into the game. So uh, just remember that name of Lady Comstock. Any more? Fun? Okay. The Lamb of the Future of Our City. Wait, the Lamb of the Future of Our City. So as we can see, Lady Comstock gave birth to this child. <laughs> Such a bad guy. We're just taking the money that, that uh, people are just leaving here. Okay, it's nothing here. Okay, let's keep moving. Because we wasted a lot of time in here. And how the hell could it... And how the how in the world are, have people have not slipped by coming down these stairs? Well, they should have done a little scene here that uh, Booker should have followed. That would have been funny. And every year, on this day of days, we recommit ourselves to our city and to our prophet, Father Thompson. We recommit through sacrifice and the giving of thanks. I control the batteries all low. And I forgot to recharge the battery overnight when starting to play through this game. And lo, if the prophet has struck down the vengeance at the end of me and not railed against the sovereign wind. The path of forgiveness is, is only is the only way to the city. Newly come to Columbia to be warded clean before our prophet, our father. 
founders and our lord. I just need passage into the city. Passage to the city. Brother, the only way to Columbia is through rebirth in the sweet waters of baptism. Will you be cleansed, brother? Let's end with this or turn around and get back on that rocket. Might as well get it over with. Come and be cleansed. Accept the baptism to enter the city. And all these people are looking at us. Hey, I'm just looking to pass through. Hey. I baptize you in the name of our prophet, in the name of our founders, and the name of our Lord. <laughs> I don't know, brothers and sisters, but this one doesn't look clean to me. Who's there? Who's there? Bring us the curb and wipe away the jet! What do you want? We have a deal to wait. Open this door right now! I told you! I'm not gonna do it! Go away! Mr. DeWitt! Mr. DeWitt! Book of DeWitt, an investigator into... Math Matthews? Matthews? Uh... So the priest has that idiot priest needs to learn the difference between baptizing a man and That's what I was going to say Booker. <laughs> you took the words right out of my mouth. I need to find a landmark and figure out where the hell I am. Locate the statue of Colombia. And no, not the Colombia in South America. Uh, this is a different Colombia. So now we've know so now we know the name of this entire city. It is Colombia. So we'd be hearing a lot of the, a lot of the name so uh, I guess accidentally, the uh, the uh, the baptizer has uh, I guess accidentally drowned us or tended to, so we could enter through the city. And now we hear, and now we see Father Jefferson, uh, Father Washington, and then Father Franklin. So, yeah, so now they're, they're referenced to Benjamin Franklin, George Washington, and Thomas Jefferson. Now, as you now, uh, we kind of get the theme of this being a religious place. But if anyone has known their history, uh, that uh, that uh, Franklin, Washington, and Jefferson were not religious; they were secular. They were atheists, and that's why they gave the birth of the Constitution and all the things like that to prevent religious. Uh, to prevent uh, uh, religious um, agendas from uh, ever becoming a thing in the United States. That's why, of course, uh, America became the first ever secular country. Second to Turkey and stuff like that, but... So they may better love the air. Oh yeah, second to Turkey, uh, I think some places in India? Or I think the entire country of India in total? But I know, I, but I know about uh, the Turkey, India. I don't know. Like I said, I think some places in India, or I think the whole country of, yeah. But that I, that I know, and then, of course, um, and then uh, the U.S. after the uh, after the uh, the Revolutionary War. What is Colombia, if not another arc for another time? And now, uh, before that, uh, so now the whoever uh, made this place uh, saw uh, the founding fathers as religious people, and as we know through our history, they weren't. He who crossed the Delaware with flaming sword and wings of angels, watch over me and lend me strength 
shield my mind from fear and doubt, so that I may hold fast against all invaders. Father Washington, hear my prayer. Good Lord. Now, this is the reason why I, uh, I kind of hate, but at the same time, love how they put religious, uh, uh, a religious background. I would say, well, if you want to say religious background or religious uh, context into the game. Share with me your wisdom and let the light of your good judgment shine like a beacon through the darkness. Father Jefferson, hear my prayer. Jesus Christ. By the sword and the scroll and the key. Amen. So as you well, forgot to show, uh, each one of the founding fathers has holding a key, a scroll, and a sword. Which will become important to later. Only providence, and that you see its divine. Okay, I, I don't want to. I don't want to keep. Just because the city flies, don't mean it ain't got its fair share of that, fools. That's what I said. All right. So got a girl to yeah, that's what I said, Booker. Uh, a little bit personal fact of me: uh, I am not religious at all. I'm an atheist. I'm a secular. I don't believe in any uh, any of the religions. But for people that do. Uh, don't worry. There, there's a lot of good religious people out there. That uh, yeah, there's a lot of uh, a lot of uh, uh, people that uh, believe in the religions and don't uh, force the religions into other people. But then there are other people, uh, other religious people that that force religious down your throat to uh, get their message out there, and that's the people I hate. Even though, I, even though I'm, I was born and raised uh, in a Catholic family, I still don't believe in any of the of the religion at all. I just don't. New Eden Square. So now we made it into a new spot, or a new uh, part of the area. <laughs> that that right there is a little bit of a, of a reference. If anyone has uh, read the Bible, uh, you will know that uh, one of the sins is eating different kinds of seafood, like oysters. So I kind of like how they put that in there. And trust me, I've read the Bible. I've been to, uh, I've been to. Uh, uh, I wouldn't. I, I was never in Catholic. I, I was never in Catholic school. I was mostly in public schools throughout my, um, throughout my life. But uh, I did do my first confirmation and other things like that. So I did. I did read the Bible. There's some good parts of the Bible, and there's some terrible parts of the Bible. <laughs> Trust me on that. Trust me, I've read through it. And there's book to it. Uh, reading through, uh, looking through some trash. Good to see. Yeah, and, and we've been picking up a lot of food, which I forgot to mention, is uh, your health. Perfect day for the celebration. Father Comstock must have foreseen and planned it just this way. Huh. So now we're seeing a statue. That statue? I just think it fails to capture Father Comstock's absolute... Divinity. Okay, so now we're seeing a big statue of Father Comstock, and uh, we'll be hearing a lot of, Co of Father Comstock as we get further into the game. And uh, now, since we made it into a new part of, yeah, and now we since made it to a new part, uh, well, a new area of the city. I'm going to end the first episode for now. So next time on Bioshock Infinite. We're going to be going on. We're going to. We're going to be. We're going to keep on going, and explore a little bit more of Colombia. Until next time.